Alrighty, it's Randy Weldon here again. Welcome you back for another portion of Eat That Frog. So we're going to go right ahead and move right into chapter 10. Take it one barrel at a time. There's an old saying, by the yard it's hard, but inch by inch anything's a cinch. And we're again uh, going to be talking about the things that, uh, that challenge us to eat those large mammoth frogs. Uh, and, you know, we get frustrated, uh, we allow procrastination to creep in, uh, anything to deter us from doing that. But when we do allow those things to come in, or, or we just, just don't want to do it anymore, we don't reach our goals. But we've got to persevere and move forward. And we're going to uh, talk about that here. Crossing the Great Sahara Desert. Uh, many people have lost their lives trying to cross the desert over the years and continue because it's a featureless desert because it's always changing. Uh, you may go to sleep one night and there's something out there and all of a sudden it's changed. Uh, things, the, the wind is always moving. Uh, but the French solved this a while back and what they came up was with big old giant oil barrels, fit together oil drums. And what they did to, uh, to solve the problem to navigate across this uh, big desert is that they took the, the, the 55 gallon drums and they placed them out every five kilometers. Now those five kilometers are very important because uh, that had to do with the circumference of the earth. So you can get out there and about every five you should be able to see, every five kilometers, you should be able to see two barrels ahead. And all you have to do is just follow the breadcrumbs, if you will, or the oil bread barrels to cross safely across the desert. And how you do that? One barrel at a time. And this is kind of like what we're talking about is how we take on the big frogs in our life. It's one barrel at a time. We don't need to take on the full thing. And I think that's just uh, what we have to do. So in overcoming this and taking action is overcoming, overcoming procrastination and accomplishing extraordinary things by taking the first step getting started toward your goal and then taking it one step one oil barrel at a time and really that's how we can overcome this is that just do what you got to do map it out write out all the things that you have to do to accomplish your goals and don't don't get discouraged don't 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 fall back because i'm here to help you uh get reach out again i'll go back and emphasize get connected with someone to work with you to hold you accountable and again, taking these steps, taking these steps. But as you're going, I think you you start seeing that your steps are not just five kilometers. They're a little bit larger and larger, and you can accomplish more. Or in some cases, they have to be smaller. It's one kilometer at a time, depending on the size of your task. And But you have to map that out and, and, and figure that out. But we can, we're always here to help. Just reach out, give us a call or a holler. All right, so that's pretty much it for Chapter 10. And we'll see you in chapter 11 coming up shortly. And God bless you. Have a great day.